Hello, in this video we're going to be working through a De Morgan's Law example where we're going to try and simplify this uh, equation into something quite simple. I've run it through uh, Wolfram Alpha and the result is actually a, a truth table which is essentially a, a not and gate, so a NAND gate. Um, so ideally we've got, as long as the two inputs are not A and B together, then uh, the output is true. So if we look at this, what we're trying to do is simplify this equation in just, into just this part and we're trying to remove all of this. So how do we do it? Well, the first thing we're going to try and do is remove the two not gates So at the top. So we're going to uh, simplify this and go, or just not simplify it, but change it using De Morgan's uh, law of not A and B is equal to not A or not B. So let's do that. Then we're going to break this one up. So we're going to have not A is now equal to not uh, not a and uh, b not not. Now, if you look at the rules again over, um, oops, what's going on with my mouse? There we go. If you look at the rules over here, not not cancels itself out. So I'm just going to remove that bit there. Now the next thing I'm going to do is try and expand these because I don't like having an OR gate and an AND gate like this uh, joined together with a with another uh, uh, OR gate. So what we're going to do is we're going to kind of um, expand this out a little bit. So we're going to treat this as a particular object and this as another object. Okay, and we're going to say that A uh, or B or not A. So we've expanded that part out and we're going to join it with an AND gate. Do the same thing again. Not A or not B or B. So I've basically taken these two and pulled this one over and then I've done that again and pulled this one over the second time and I've joined the two things with an AND gate. Now what I can do is use these laws and simplify these down. So the two not uh, A's, if we look here, A or A is equal to A. So I can actually just cancel these out and say, well, that's just A or B like so and uh, when we look at this one not B or B well we've got something like that over here where we've got A or not A is equal to 1 so that kind of leaves us with this not A uh, or 1 what I can then do is say well okay what happens now when I've got an A or a 1 well, that just goes to one, so I'm going to I can simplify this even further. So now we can say right, not a or not b and one. Well, what happens now when we've got something like uh, uh, an input and a one? Well, when we've got an input or uh, and a one, if we look at these, it just becomes that input. So I can basically get rid of this one and just result to not a and B because I did I basically looked at this and I said well not B and 1 is equal to not B so that leaves us with not A or not B and if you look back here we kind of already converted to this point we can leave it at this or we can say that we have using this law of uh, not A or not B is equal to not A and B so we finish with the knot of A and B, which satisfies our truth table uh, here. So knot A and B. And that is correct. And that's the end of that video. So I hope you found that useful. Um, if you did, do check out the other De Morgan Law videos for practice. And I will continue to post up some more videos when I get a chance. Take care.